welcome back to the channel guys and girls welcome back today as requested by some of you guys i will be doing a challenge slash do they even freaking work video and what we've got here is another berkeley power bank product these are called mice tails they're essentially like a little floating ball i guess a uh, power power egg slash maybe power bait style i'm sure they are scented and they've got a trout worm attached to one end I have no freaking clue how to use these. I've always thought they were kind of goofy looking. I've never purchased them. But you guys wanted to see it, so here we are. Um, I'm assuming these float, and I'm assuming these are meant to be fished from the bottom. So I've rigged up a double split shot rig with a tiny little circle hook, and I'm gonna rig these guys up straight. And I wanna see if I can even catch a fish on these. So this looks like the best color to me. So I'm gonna pop in here, I'm gonna grab this, I'm gonna show you guys the setup, and we're gonna dive straight in. I'm going to start off using a double split shot and a hook here. I think this is a size six, a little bit bigger than I normally use. I'm just going to pop out one of these mice tails by Berkeley. I'm going to grab him right on out of there, just like so. And there we go. That is the bait. Now, my guess is this head here will float along with the tail, I assume. So I'm going to take our hook and I'm just going to run him right through the tip. I'm going to run him right down into that. Yeah, I'm going to run right down into that worm just a little bit, not much. I'm just going to pull it right on back out there. Try to expose plenty of that hook. Um, this is going to be my first test. I don't really know if this is how you do this. I assume it'll float like power bait. It definitely stinks like it. So let's go ahead and make our first cast and we'll see how it does. already snagged up here. Okay, and that's one of the biggest reasons I don't like fishing along the bottom. And just like that, we are one mice tail down. Okay, so I've had no luck on the uh, pink tailed color. So let's switch it up to a totally different color, see if we can get some attention here. We are going to be switching up to orange with a white body. I'm going to attempt the same rigging. I'm going to continue rigging this way for a little while until I have completely determined that this just isn't going to be the deal. And in that time, I will change my approach hopefully to something you know that'll work this doesn't look bad though i mean all in all that looks pretty catchable to me but i'm not really sure so let's go ahead and get out there and let's find out Ooh, there was a bite, boys and girls. Yes, it was. There we go. Well, I guess you can catch one on a Berkeley mice tail. It did take a while, and I caught him literally right here by this tree. But we caught one. They worked. All right. Let's just flip this little beauty right on up here into the net. Just like so. Heck yeah. And there we go. We caught ourselves a Berkeley mice tail fish. Oh, popped right on up. Heck yeah. Not a bad one. I'd say about a pound. There's a little closer look. All right. I don't want to try yet another pink and white. I do feel like that this right here is the ideal color just because I, you know, I really have had a lot of luck with the pink worms themselves. Um, I'm just going to hook this up just like we have been. Pull him right on up past the eye there, just like so.
There we go. That took a little doing, but we got one. Another small guy, but that's okay. So this rig is pretty effective. I do feel like my hook may be a little large, thus weighting the um, thus weighting the overall bait down some. But we are still catching them. Let's go ahead and give this little girl a flip into the net. There we go. A pretty little fish here. Not very much size, but there's our bait. And there's our fish. So let's just go on ahead and allow her just to take right on off. Nice swift pop in. All right. I hope you guys can hear me over all this uh, noise. Chartreuse tail was not working. So let's grab us out a red body and a brown tail. guys that's a big one. Oh yeah we got to make our way right on down off of this dam to net this fish Okay, we made our way on down here. You can see that old red power egg sticking right out of the side of the mouth there. Alrighty, boys and girls. Right in the corner of the mouth. And there we go. Right there's our worm. Let's just let this little puppy take right on off here. And there she goes. Heck yeah. All right, we've got our orange body here with our yellow tail again. This bait has been our kryptonite. We have not been able to successfully catch a fish on this. Before we get started, I'd like to go on ahead and give a special thanks to the guys at Blue Springs for having me out today to film this video for you guys. I'm gonna leave their link in the description. If you would like to come out here and fish yourself, just give them a call, set it up. And you can be out here just like I am. If you want a chance to win some of these here, I'm gonna be giving away two sets of three to two lucky winners just leave a comment down below like this video make sure you're subscribed send them right to you good luck